Hey, what's up? It's Steve, AKA the sign picker. And today I'm going to update the sign wall. Now it's been about eight months since I last updated the wall. I did it last for back to school and here we are in May. So it's about time that it gets an update. And it really is going to be all about time because the signs today that I'm going to pull out and feature all include days and or times on them. So those of you who have seen my sign wall updates before, you know the drill. I'm gonna start going through the collection, start finding some things, rediscovering some signs I forgot I have, all within the theme of signs that have days, dates, or times on them. So let's start picking. Okay, so I'm gonna start going through all of these signs, picking through one by one. Uh, I'll pick out way too many than can actually fit on the wall. And then we go through a process of elimination to determine what actually goes up on the wall. Uh, so let's dig in. I'm gonna start with this big section here. Problem is these are kind of tall. They might not fit on the wall. That's gonna be really tough, but we'll see what we can find. All right, so here's one. Got times on them. RTA, CTA, culture, bus stop. I got this sign for about 20 bucks at an antique store uh, in the 90s. So I'm super thrilled that I have it. Uh, it's double-sided, it's pretty cool. We'll pull that out. Okay, here's one from my time at Ball State. This is a residence hall parking sign, uh, 24 hour Monday through Friday, days and kind of times, 24 hours. Here's a no right turn Monday through Friday with times on it. And here's the counterpart to that guy. Uh, it just says no left turn. Uh, so we have a pair. A lot of speed limit signs in here. We'll do a speed limit wall someday. Okay, that's it for the 24 by 36. Let's hop in here. These are all gonna be stop signs. Obviously, the only sign that's an octagon shape. Warning signs with symbols typically don't have times on them or days. But we'll see what we can come up with here. I don't want to skip a pile and potentially leave something out. It's like a FOMO thing. We might just come up blank in this section, but at least we tried. Let's see if there's anything in here. These are oblong shaped signs. I know I have an embossed one in here somewhere. Maybe that one. Nope. I thought it had dates and times on it, as I recall, but it doesn't, it doesn't count. Okay. Nothing there. Let's jump over here. Because I just want to make sure that I don't forget something that I have. This only has prices on it. No dates or times. One, this is another Ball State related sign. Uh, this probably had to do with uh, dorm move-out day. Um, no parking after 10 p.m. Friday, May 4th. It's about the time when campus was letting out for the school year. They would put up these temporary signs. Ball State has its own uh, sign shop, and obviously they don't follow the manual on uniform traffic control device standards. Um, I don't know if they still use this style now, but at least back when I went there, uh, this is what they all looked like. Here is a temporary San Francisco uh, street sign. It's made of cardboard. Uh, they would just tie it up with um, uh, either rope or I think it was string uh, when I saw it. Uh, you can see there's a cool stencil under it and then somebody just overlaid a label with Times New Roman on top of it. So the stencil look, looks much cooler. Uh, we'll throw that in the pile. I have a feeling that this section right here these 12 by 18s, parking signs. I can see one right here already. That section's gonna have a lot of date and time stuff on it. Let's pull him out. Okay, here's one here, 20 minute parking. 
very cool texture on it. Uh, the 20 uh, is about peeling off there. So they would make these signs as templates and then have um, separate numbers that you can apply. And here's one from the Los Angeles Traffic Department for street cleaning, noon to two. Here's another parking sign, two hour parking, six to six. All right, here's another one. This one kind of looks like that one, uh, just a little bit different. A uh, little bit different styling of the times and the days there. So we'll keep that one out. Another Ball State sign, 24 hour tow for the residence hall director three only. Here's a really great one. This is a 30 minute parking, 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. police. And I love that little police at the bottom. I'm pretty sure this is a new old stock. It doesn't seem to have any markings on it, any indication that it was ever used uh, out of Rochester, New York. It's embossed, shiny, perfect condition, except for a couple scratches. Very awesome. And right behind him, is no parking for street cleaning. You see this sign used to be red on white. Somebody painted over black at some point. Here's another old guy. No parking, seven to five weekdays only. Emboss stamped. I like it. Let's see if there's anything back here that I'm missing. These are signs that I picked up last year. I still need to file them. Here's a no parking sign. That's cool. And here, traffic lane sign.